I have here a beautiful and fresh local honey that a friend gave me. As soon as I got it, I started working on a recipe for a delicious honey and oat bread that goes great as a toast bread for my morning coffee. To start this recipe, place 240 grams or one cup of water in the bowl of a stand mixer. Add 80 grams or a quarter cup of the best honey you have available. Look how delicious this honey looks. Add 100 grams or a third of a cup of sourdough starter. You can use a 50% hydration sourdough starter for this recipe or your regular 100% hydration sourdough starter. Add 100 grams or one and a quarter cups of 100% whole grain oats. You can use any kind of oats that you have at hand. Use the hook attachment to mix the ingredients until the sourdough starter dissolves in the mix. Then add 350 grams or two and three quarter cups of all-purpose flour and knead until all the ingredients are well incorporated. Add 60 grams or a quarter cup of butter at room temperature, cut in pieces, little by little, as you keep mixing the dough, and add 7 grams or 1 and a half teaspoons of salt. Mix for about 20 minutes or until your dough is soft, elastic, and it doesn't stick to the walls of your bowl. You can also knead this dough easily by hand, since it is not a high hydrated dough. Take the dough out of the bowl and place it on your working table. Finish kneading the dough and make a bowl. Place the dough in a grease bowl. Cover the bowl with a plastic lid or a plastic wrap and let the dough proof for about four hours in a warm place or until it doubles in size. Take the dough out of the bowl, stretch and fold it a couple times and shape it carefully so you don't degas the dough. Add tension to the dough as you keep shaping it and place it in a one pound non-stick love pan. Cover it with a lid and let the dough proof for another couple hours or until the dough reaches the rim of the pan. Place the loaf in a preheated oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 180 degrees Celsius for 3 minutes or until your bread is golden brown. Remove the pan from the oven and place it on a cooling rack. Remove the lid and turn the pan around on the cooling rack and remove the pan to let the bread cool completely. This bread is so simple to make, soft and delicious. The natural sweetness of the oats and the addition of honey makes this a very delicious bread that you can enjoy with your favorite marmalade and your favorite coffee. Thank you for watching this video. Like and share this video. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. I have a new video every week.